Your News Now Sports. Good evening, everyone. Tyler Segerman here with you. The standard for high school tennis around Lima, well, continues to set that mark. The Shawnee boys team just wrapped up a perfect season in the WBL, sweeping the league with a record of 60 and 0. But past success doesn't always result in future achievement, a concept this team understands as they get set for a state run. Yeah. We like people coming for us. We use that as motivation. Fuel that once again led this program to finish atop the Western Buckeye League. For the 11th time in 14 seasons. I'm proud of these guys and making sure they're never taking anything for granted and day by day just continue to work on to be better. Postseason play, now the focus for Shawnee, with sectionals at UNOH serving up on Thursday. Indians possess two state qualifiers from a year ago who have a combined record of 45-5 and five this season. Don't be too passive on the ball. Obviously, don't try and overhit and just smack into the fence, but a little more aggressive, faster, heavier balls. I won't be too challenged until the semifinals, probably, of sectionals. Then in district, obviously, I'm going to have some tough matches and say, obviously. Top singles player Gabe Burke aims to score his first career win at state after advancing to Mason as a freshman in 2021. Junior Mason Stahl, who also got a taste of the big stage, will switch gears and partner with classmate Mac Davis, bolstering a chance for a return on the double side. To be able to get farther, uh, we'll be able to handle the competition better. We make a pretty good team. I'm at the ground strokes, he's at the net. We do pretty good like that. Me and Mason are friends from school, so we have that tight bond, and we've played tennis together for a while, so... We should be able to have our chemistry together. On top of pursuing an OHSAA state championship, the Tribe are in the midst of a OTCA title as well, hosting powerhouse Lexington next Monday for the right to move on in the coaches team tournament. That's a big match. It's going to be a dogfight for sure. Uh, it's it's going to be a close one, a good one to watch. We're hoping that a lot of people are going to come out and support us here. Aggressive but humble remains the message from WBL Coach of the Year, Mitchell Chavez. Since the beginning of this season, don't let up. Don't think that it's going to be an easy run again just because of what happened the previous season. You don't know how it's going to fall this year, and you don't know who's going to be there. So because of that, I've made sure that these guys committed all the way through. Oh! 